Hello there guys, it's me and Stable Voltage. Welcome back to episode 25 of Civilization 6 as Samaria. And I just noticed how much money I've got. Decided I'm going to go over here and we are going to purchase ourselves... Um, a few aircraft, I think. So, yeah, they have more melee strength on the fighters. So we want to get... I mean, they're expensive. We can only really afford one, but it'll certainly help us against... Um, China if they should decide they're going to attack but nobody's China's still friendly with us despite the fact that we had units on their borders and we apparently broke our promise to them being denounced by Brazil again because we have uh, more great people than he does that's to be expected yeah even though we technically don't have those great people anymore because they've all been sort of expended but we are going to keep trying to push our religion onto this other continent it's a shame we can't get Arkan I really don't know what it is that stops these cities from flipping sometimes. Um, so we do have an apostle over here. And uh, yeah, we want to try and get Valletta if we can. We also want to try and get Trier. Though we had trouble with Trier last time. Um, so we could sort of deploy you over here just to defend. So deploying actually protects a number of uh, tiles around. I believe it does anyway. Can't actually remember now. Let's have a look at um, air combat. Combat. Um, city combat, no. Air combat. Introduction. Um, air bases, patrols. Fighter aircraft can be deployed to a valid hex within their movement range from a friendly airbase. After it's deployed, the aircraft will begin flying an orbiting pattern around its effective intercept range, which is currently a one hex radius. Uh, this should make it more clear to both the attacker and the defender the status of the fighter in the patrol state. Um, so really, we're just kind of fortified there. We're actually on this tile. Um, need to click it again. So, yeah, maybe we actually need to send you back home. But we'll do that. On, I, I don't really know. I haven't really, haven't really done much with the uh, air combat on this game, if I'm honest. I haven't done anything with the air combat on this game, if I'm honest. Messed around, but not really used it for anything. So let's keep trying to get this apostle forward. We've got other units that do need movement. Um, we'd like to get you up to Trier if we can. You're already at Trier. So let's keep trying to flip it if we can. Um... I can't really see the icon. It looks like that, that icon is just the icon for the um, for the Pantheon. So it is really weird. I'm not too sure what why we can't flip it all the way over. The same goes for Arkan. Maybe maybe Arkan is because it's a, a, a religious city. All I know is something weird is going on. Should have another trade route available soon. There we go. Let's just make sure we're not going to get an accidental um, cultural victory. No, we're not even close, so that's good. We weren't aiming for one, but I wasn't aiming for one on my Rome game when I uh, accidentally got one either. So you do have to be careful. So I'm not going to bother with Trier. We're just going to go ahead and try and move you up to Valletta. Um, the same goes with for you, actually. Uh, and we do have this trade route. Now, I'm guessing we probably still can't trade with the other continent. Yeah, we're just a little bit too far away unfortunately. Uh, do we genuinely not have a um, trading post in here? Should say if we do. Um, okay then, I guess we continue with um, Cordoba. Gives us some faith, gives us some culture, gives us some gold. Gives us a little bit of science, but we're not really bothered about that. Um, as it's just decided to turn the turn back over to me, let's make sure we go ahead and get another missionary. Need to get them as often as we can. Uh, Apostle. So you want to get over there to Valletta. Getting excited now. Actually quite close to getting this victory. Still a fair bit of work to do. Yeah, this these two cities have flipped back over again. Which I, I kind of feared that they would. Um, there's not much I can do about that unless I want to send a massive apostle army over to Rio and try and flip it to my religion. Which is going to be difficult to say the least. 
Uh, you are on counterintelligence, or at least you're supposed to be. So let's go ahead and get you doing that. And that um, that fighter, I think we will just... Um... Rebase and just send you home. Um, so you're going to get over here now. You need to get in the water. Uh, you need to get over here as well. You're really struggling with all of this crappy terrain. But there's not much I can do about that. This missionary, I think I'm going to send back up to um, Hamburg and see if we can flip that back to back to our side. But yeah, if there was if there are actually any Brazilian um, missionaries over here that we could fight, that would be fantastic. But they've all disappeared. Yeah, declaration of friendship with China. I'll go ahead and take that. I mean, they're probably the most powerful uh, civilization in this game, apart from myself. So, being friendly with them is not a bad idea. And um, let's just also not forget one of our unique uh, things, which we haven't used because we haven't had any allies. But um, may declare war on anyone at war with their allies without warmonger penalties. So if someone declares war on China, we can declare war back on them without getting any warmonger penalties. Uh, when at war with a common foe, they and their allies share pillage rewards and share combat experience gains if within five tiles. So there's quite some nice things going on with that. Uh, so you are just going to basically uh, sleep for now. Um... Yeah, Brazil, why don't you have any missionaries around? Now, what's going to be your easiest cities to flip? This is probably one of them. Just love to find some of those flipping missionaries. We want to get you over there. Right, you're a missionary. You're going to be used to try and flip. But yeah, so much pressure around them. They're, they're difficult to get. Do you know what? Let's just go ahead and use this missionary. We can soon get another missionary up there later. Um, we can't afford another missionary right now, I don't think. Because I think they've gone up in price again. Yeah, 365. So Inquisitors can only be used in your own cities. May eliminate the presence of other religions in their territory. Yeah, so it has to be our own territory for that to work. I mean, we could just always try and go and capture Rio, but I just I don't really see any point in it. Uh, some big wars just kicked off. You want to give me Niter. Um, No, that's a crappy deal. So I'm quite interested just to see who's just declared a war there. Um, China. Uh, looks like China and Brazil just gone to war with each other. Is that a barbarian attacking my uh, scout? It is. Well, I'm going to move out of the way. You can be uh, Brazil's problem. Uh, Tuesday production down in Ur. What have we finished here? Uh, I guess we could work on a spy. It would take a long time to get a spy, though. Get another archaeologist. I don't really need most of this stuff, to be honest. Um, could we put a holy site anywhere useful? Get... Plus two if we put one there. Let's go and get a holy site then. Anything that gives us more faith gain has got to be worth it. Let's use a spread on you. A spread on you. There we go. We've got Valletta now. We still don't have Germany though because another city flipped back. So it's sort of... Causing us some issues, definitely. Let's get rid of all of these. So what we could do now is actually we could declare war on Brazil. Without getting any warmonger penalties, but really, what's the point? I don't have any units nearby anyway. So, we'll start trying to spread with these apostles. Now, this might upset Scythia. I don't know how she feels about uh, being converted. So, we'll have to keep her eye on that one. But uh, we do have a fair bit of our own religious pressure doing well. Uh, you're still supposed to be counters. I wish it would automatically just return to the counter spy options when counter spying was what they were doing originally. I should have actually. Oh, I was going to say I should have actually bought a missionary on that uh, turn, but we can. 
Because it uh, luckily there was a unit that I hadn't moved. So let's go ahead and do that. So you need to get into the water. Now we can go on to the next turn. So close now. Now, Scythia looks like she has seven or eight cities. So we're going to have to get half of them. Uh, that works out in my favour, so we'll give that a go. Our income's still very good. And I'm not too worried about being attacked by China now. I mean, that's not to say that he might not stab me in the back, but he certainly seems to like me, so we'll keep that going. Uh, Preslav has pieced out with Kabul. Why only Kabul? Did Kabul get their city back somehow? Um, that was over here, wasn't it? No, Kabul is still... Um, that's just weird. I don't, know what, I don't know what's going on in this game half the time. Right, we've got our missionary over here. You need to start heading this way. Uh, Valletta has flipped. Probably should... Um, go over there and try and get Hamburg back. And, uh, yeah, it's going to take a fair bit to flip you over, but what other options do we have, really? We need to try and get it done. So, let's start moving you over. What I'd really like to be able to do, and I can't quite do it right at the moment, but I'd like to be able to get a missionary out sort of every turn. Uh, I'm also a little bit disappointed... Wow, you, you've got a lot more movement than I expected. Uh, I'm also a little bit disappointed that the AI isn't actually... Um... I guess you've got nothing left to explore, have you? Because the map's fully uncovered. Um, I'm a little bit disappointed that the AIs that I've already converted aren't producing their own missionaries and spreading my religion for me. I mean, theoretically, it's not something you'd ever want to do. As a player... If somebody else gave you their religion, you don't want to spread it for them. Because if you start spreading somebody else's religion, then you're going to um, uh, help them win a religious victory. But the AI does tend to do it quite a lot because the AI is quite dumb. So let's sort of get you onto the roads where we can. Uh, we can afford to get another missionary now. So let's keep them going. They are getting more and more expensive though, so there's that to bear in mind. So we're trying to flip um, Nuremberg. Will take a while. We've got this apostle. I don't think uh, that uh, worker, that barbarian worker, can't do anything to us, so we should be fine there. Unit needing orders. What a surprise. Missionary, you need to get into the water, which you can't do just yet. And again, it's going to be a few turns before we can get another missionary. But yeah, it might be a better idea just to try and flip over some of the big cities. I know that my original plan was target the smaller cities because they'll be easier to flip. And we only need half the cities in each civilization. Um, but the big cities are putting out so much pressure that they keep flipping stuff back, which isn't helping. Not helping at all. Uh, got a promotion. What did we manage there? We've disrupted rocketry. Fantastic. Um, sabotage production. Time to complete all missions reduced by 25%. Yeah, we want to give you that because we're going to be moving you to the other city in a moment. And sabotaging their rocketry once more. Um, so you can try another spread. You're going to try and get over there and you're going to try another one. It is going to be tricky. Definitely tricky. But I will not give up. So you need to get yourself down here as well as quick as you can. Still don't have enough faith to get another one. Constantly disrupting uh, China's production is helping as well, so that is good. But yeah, we need to flip Hamburg back over. We need to flip uh, Galonus back over as well. Even though the future seems far away, one day there will be no borders. So no we're just constantly working over and over again on future tech now. As for civics, um, there are still some we could backfill in. Uh, we could just keep going for globalization. Um, but let's just, let's just start filling, filling some of them in. Let's get social media. So what we can do now um, is... Oh, no, we don't want to change government. We want to replace that. Um, plus five production and ten gold from international trade routes. Well, we do have quite a few. 109 gold we're currently on. Um...
175. Yeah, that was significant. Um, so you are now going to move back to um, Zayan. Because we need to keep trying to... Um... It's not saying that I can disrupt. This. Maybe they haven't repaired it yet. That would be really weird if they haven't. Um, Scythia's actually uh, almost got a space race uh, thing going on here. Oh, maybe we need to deal with her instead then. We'll, we'll bring that spy back on the next turn, I think, if we can. I don't think we can cancel it on this turn, but yeah, we need to bring you back. Scythia's the one that's likely to be the problem now. Uh, still not enough faith to get another missionary, unfortunately. Uh, we do have one here. Valletta we already have. So we're going to keep trying to get Nuremberg if we can. I kind of wish I had a city over here. Just so that we could produce the units a little bit more quickly. A little bit disappointing that we can't. Still not seeing any Brazilian... Um, Brazilian units. Brazil have got another city down here actually. Didn't even realise they had that. Tuesday production. We have finished... Um, we could work on the Pagoda for four turns, I suppose. Let's go ahead and do that. Extra six faith will be useful. Oh, you finished the spy. That's what you were doing. So let's go and send you over to... Coloba. Because we want to disrupt rocketry. Pretty low chance of it happening. Uh, but we will try and... Um, Gain sources first. Uh, you need to get up here. Try and get over as quick as you can. You're not doing too bad. Uh, that should be enough to purchase another missionary. 375 Faith. I wonder if there's a cap. A maximum cost that they can go up to. Because otherwise it would just end up getting ridiculous. So you need to be in the water. Let's end the turn there. So we've got to be careful here, because if we don't hurry up... Um, wow, you want to give me quite a lot. I'll take that. I don't really need the money, but we'll do it anyway. Uh, if we're not careful, the AI are going to get a victory. They're not going to get a religious or a domination victory. They're not going to get a cultural victory, but they may well get a um, a, a science victory if we don't slow them down. Um, a spy from the Brazilian Empire was killed during the mission to, to the city of Sapar. Right, so we've actually killed one of their spies. Interesting. That'll learn you. Um, trade route. We want international trade routes. I think you're going to go to Cordoba. Uh, we're also going to go ahead and just denounce Pedro. Um, have the actually have the option to denounce now. I suppose it's because he's denounced me. I mean, I could CB on him. Um, but we don't really need to. I've got no units over there that can attack him right now anyway. So I'm just trying to get all my missionaries and everything into place to get cities flipped. You try and get to the water if you can actually manage to get across there at some point. Um, you definitely need to continue with the old counter-spying. Excellent work. So it might have even been them before and not China. It's possible. Uh, Levetta we've still got. Nuremberg is the one we're trying to flip. So we need to get over here if we can. Can't do it on this turn. But the more cities we can get flipped over, the better. I'm a little bit worried that Levet is going to flip back. It hasn't yet. Looks like um, Brazil's actually at war with Germany. Uh, that is Cristo Redental. Yep, China. Uh, sorry, uh, Spain did finish it before. I did, which is what I fully expected to happen. But I thought I'd give it a go anyway. So we've got time for a couple more turns before we have to end. Choose our production. So obviously Rome can't do that anymore. We might as well build this armory just because we can. Um, yeah, you, you can sort of auto-explore, but there isn't really an awful lot left for you to do now. We might be able to clear that camp out here if we're, uh, if we're crafty. And you are a melee unit, so you'll just move in and, and kill it off unless he suicides itself. We'll see what happens on that score. It might work out in our favour. 
So let's keep trying to spread over here at Nuremberg. We do need to get ourselves another um, missionary. I think we can afford one here. We can. So it's still going up. Five per turn. Well, let's just keep going this way. It's a shame we can't get to the road. We'll go on for another turn, though. See what happens. Might be nice if Germany actually throw some units at Brazil here. Um... Because if they can destroy Rio, or capture Rio, it would make it easier for me to um, get some units in there. Tuesday production. We, what were we doing? Was it the um, Operation Ivy? So what we could do if we wanted to is build a thermonuclear device. We can't do anything else right now, so let's go and build a thermonuclear device. They cost a fair bit to... Um, to keep but yeah let's go ahead and get a, get a couple of nukes just in case we need them in case somebody upsets us uh let's go ahead here and get the broadcast center uh you are counter spying again hate that i have to click that twice all the time if I just click counter spy it should just take me to the counter spy menu uh so you need to get out of here out of the way you need to get over here and eventually get yourself in the water if you can Keep trying to flip Nuremberg. Yeah, Hamburg's gone back the other way. And uh, we'll just do this one more turn and that will be the last one. So how far can we get you through? Not quite as far as we'd like. That wasn't the turn, by the way. That was just because I had units left to move. So we'll do one more turn. Still won't quite have enough faith to buy another missionary. We've all, we're almost getting enough faith to get a missionary each turn. We're definitely getting enough faith to get a missionary every... Um, sorry, we get, we've almost got enough faith to get a missionary every two turns. But we're currently getting one every three. See, I don't have any troops on your borders. Apart from the borders which you made by settling right next to me. Uh, triggers a eureka moment for all technologies from the information era. I already have all technologies from the information era. But I'm going to take him because that will stop the AI from using him. So, you know, it's a, it becomes a little bit pointless. We've got a trader here. I guess we go to Madrid because that gold is looking quite sexy. Um, so, yeah, we might as well just go and pop you. Completely pointless because we've already researched everything. But now the AI can't use him either. So let's get moving over with missionaries. Can't afford another one yet. And, um, yep, you need to try and get in the water if you can. We've got another missionary over here. You can get over to Nuremberg and use one of your spreads. Still not quite enough yet. Four versus seven. And uh, I am going to end there mainly because I've gone over the 20 minute mark. And secondly, it's 12.30 and... I'm absolutely ravenous. So thanks a lot for watching, guys. I hope you are still enjoying Civilization VI. And the progression of the game has gone a little bit slower than I'd hoped. Turn 406 of a standard pace game. We still haven't got a win yet. However, we are only on episode 25. And I do believe my first game was like a 31-32 episode victory. So it is quite possible that we'll be looking for the same sort of finish. I don't really have all that much to do, in all honesty. If we do want to get this um, religious win, uh, we only need to flip Germany, which means we need one more German city. Uh, we could even just go and get Hamburg. But yeah, we need one more German city. And then we also need to go and get Tomris, which means getting... I um, don't know how many cities she actually has. She's got one up there. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven... So she has seven cities. We need to get four. So we only really need to convert five more cities total and we've won. Uh, if we go and have a look at the science victory, um, we're almost at the point where we could... We're definitely ahead of everybody else. Uh, Scythia, we are going to have to slow down. If it looks like somebody else is going to get a science victory, we'll just make sure that we are ahead so that we can get that. That's the plan anyway. But I will see you guys on the next video. And until then, goodbye for now.